So, everyone has gotten a horse now. We resolved that difference. And you started... Riding horses. Riding right. horses. Everyone yes, got riding, riding horses. horses. And a pony. Four four horses, one pony. Uh, you teach Chatterbones how to ride. He nat naturally takes to it, actually. And then he just it's chatters all along. It's killer. It's like... You know, just making that noise. It's kind of, kind of annoying. Uh, it's you know, it's funny for the first thirty seconds, but he does it for thirty minutes, kind of type deal. I have a feeling. Um, I've I've been these roads, but not the roads we're going. Um, the main roads, yes. but not you, the side roads um, or the side paths. You take a look at all the directions. Uh, make a survival check. Uh... All right. Um, Great. What? <laughs> you. It's actually okay. Uh, this first part is actually the easiest. You start heading up the coast, and you're fine until you've a couple days. Days have passed. Essentially, um, you're riding up this way. Be peeing a little bit. There we go. You start riding up that way. And who is. I, I keep getting feedback every now and then. I don't know. I'm not hearing anything. Okay. I don't hear any feedback. Yeah, All right. I'm getting a little bit. It's weird. All right. We'll be fine. Um, God, what is that? I'll just turn my sound down a little bit, maybe. Okay. So, essentially, you guys are just going the way that the puzzle has gotten you. Um, a couple, a couple uh, miles, and you need another survival check. Not a couple miles, a couple days. All right. Uh... I actually survival. I'll do. I got, I got plus two on wisdom. So, anybody else has higher? Well, it's like not rolling now. Fell has Clicking. plus five for, to survival. If anyone has yeah, higher, yeah, yeah. Why don't you do that one? Just let me just. Oh, oh my god. Fell is clearly shaken by his uncle's death. Yes. Uh oh. It's now, now settling in. My all of my. Um, Values are now going to the screen. Oh my god. Okay. I kept clicking survival and nothing happened, and then now they all jumped. All right, I must be lagging. Sorry. No, it's fine. All right, so you start going away, and you're actually um about a day. Everyone else make a perception check as you're all looking at the maps. Uh, shit. I gotta find. Damn, 13 is a popular number right now. <laughs> what the fuck? Foreboding. Atomic dice. <laughs> quantum. That quantum rolling, oh, you know. Quantum, yep. Yeah, yeah. Alright. So, Matt, I don't know if it makes a difference. Um, mm -hmm. I did take the Outlander as my background. Okay. Uh, Outlander have an excellent memory for maps and geography. You can always recall the general layout of terrain. So if it's anywhere that I've been, right. I should know just as the the background. You, you, it has terrain. this isn't anywhere you've been actually, but okay. Um, does it require that you've been there? It's just... that that one that one does, but you can recall. Oh, okay. Recall is... Okay, yeah. No, you haven't. So for... uh... You haven't been here, if actually. If we're off the path that I've been, it's no longer in place. Yeah. Um, so, no one really notices anything. Um, make another survival check. There, Phil. Oh, now it's now, yeah, now it's popping up. All right. To the winner. Phil, um, you, you start off in the day, and you just kind of, like, nudge your way 
back the way you came a little bit um, and as you realize that you made an error so a couple days uh, passed by so it's been three days overall and you've gotten actually four it's been four days you guys have made rather good ground and you've covered around 70 miles all right um, the horses are looking a little tired though so make another survival check for the third one 70 miles damn already halfway done I know god damn my dice all right. just... um, 500 miles you know you spend a couple days going to where you think you're need to be going make another survival check and everyone else can make insight insight check Jesus wow. guys I just kill things there oh alright uh, Danner you yes. notice that what clerics are for it doesn't seem that Phil knows where he's going right now and Phil you think you're unsure of yourself right now as well, but uh, Danner be or Danner, you're just like. Can I can I just officially change my name to Danner B? If you want to, I'm yes. Sorry, uh, I didn't need to. It was. It's, it's gonna gonna what I came up with. Yeah. Danner B. All right, Danner B. Um, yeah. You don't think that Fell is exactly on the right track after looking at the map and the way you've gone? Do I? Uh... Do I know enough to, to get us back on track? Make survival check. Drew, you're not sure. You can't you can't tell. Um, you spend another day. Well, I, don't, I don't feel confident, guys. I don't feel confident, guys. I'd like to ask uh, Chatterbo Chatterbones what he what he thinks. What do you mean you don't feel confident? <laughs> we are I, on, I like on the wrong the way, wrong way. of course. Do you know where you the right way is, within Chatterbones? Miles. That's true, I don't know. Direction. I'm following the directions that Tam gave me. <laughs> That's actually me coughing, just... not not Chatterbones. Oh, actually, Matt, shit, I... Are we in a forest right now? Yes. Oh, damn, I, I've been forgetting to add to that. You've been going through forests, cliffs, and hills. Okay, well, uh, wherever we're at now, I'd like to reestablish myself. Okay, you're like, okay, I'm in the forest, I got this shit. And I have my proficiency bonus because it is my favorite terrain. Alright, go yeah. for it. Is that your proficiency bonus? That's that's everything. That's no. double my proficiency bonus and survival. Alright, so you think you, you, you think uh, you're on the right path, totally. I, We are. So you you think you're you think you're on the right path. I think you're on the wrong path, but I don't know what the right path is. Well, well, fine. Um, I, why don't why don't we walk it for another few miles, and you might you might feel better about yourself. Do I, your guidance, I've, Bowie. I've been in these woods yeah, for a pretty do, long time. I'm gonna do uh, I'm gonna do guidance on you, uh, Kevin. Sorry, uh, fell. Well, oh, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you my guidance. I'm gonna add some points. All right. To your, so he kind of goes. Danby kind of goes up to you and says, "Really think about where we need to go." And you're kind of inspired to really think about it. So roll a d4 and add it to your check. There we are. Oh. You, you realize that he is right. You, you're like, wait, we're two days behind schedule now. We've gone the wrong way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry, that was me. Right? We've gone the wrong way. And No, no, um, actually, Dennerby, I appreciate it. Um, I remember this, this pathing before. There was an orc camp not too far from here that we're trying to get around. Um, and, uh, we're basically just trying to get around this... <laughs> This orc camp. <laughs> insight, insight. Um, uh, uh, Danerby. Deception. <laughs> can I, can I, can I roll to see if I can tell if he's lying? Yeah, insight, insight. Um, we, Tup and I were here before, and I remember this this encampment. Um, I I don't need your prayers. I don't need anything, but but you're right. 
Hey, we can probably you, swing you can, back at this point, but we're probably far enough away. You think I'm try and support Fell's life. <laughs> you're like, I'm positive you're telling the truth. You're, you, well, you you go over, you're like, Fell, I don't believe your story, but Atlas kind of goes, no, no, it happened like this, though. And you actually start to believe Fell. You're like, okay, I can see yeah. why we're on this way. Meanwhile, um, Reese is just like, oh my god. <laughs> my 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 uh, cousins are idiots. He, he's like, dear diary. I haven't got to crush anything in like seven days. <laughs> what am I except my? No, I'm I'm good. I'm the blood lost this building. Uh, this is this is clearly the way. Uh, I appreciate the guidance. It wasn't needed, um, but the guidance did help me to. The the prayers did help me to walk around the sword camp. I thought their territory was a bit larger. I, we don't want to encounter 40 orcs, right? We we don't want to no, get around don't. 40 orcs. No, because we're just we're just four and a robot. Right. So we're getting around it, but you're right. We're probably far enough around it at this point that uh, we should turn this way. At this point, let's let's turn back east right. and uh, right. I so find my path again. Two more. Two days later, you come to the end of the lap of the almost last piece now you have your map make a survival check the fuck jesus christ me you're like all right it's this way oh well, actually it's um it's plus three more because it's it's double uh so it should be actually 14 if that makes a difference not gonna break it not not no not yet not good oh but you're pretty sure it's this way Maybe go that way. You start going this way. In a couple days, you're like, okay, this is not where we should be. And uh, make another survival check. Denner. <laughs> Denner D. Yes. Um, Give you guidance. I don't think. I don't think the maps were right entirely. <laughs> Uh, I, you know, I think I've, a lot I've of the coordinates before. the coordinates are very subjective as, as you've noticed just walking how long is a mile how long is five miles we've been walking ten miles and it feels like five right so uh, if if your gods could lend a hand you, I would I would have bones goes. <laughs> we are still within ten miles and have been for the last day God help us <laughs> Jesus. Alright. Uh, I would like to advise first off that we listen to Chatterbones since he's programmed with the coordinates. Um But I will give you uh, guidance if you request it. Well well no, I got I got another fourteen on that. I'm I'm gonna wait for Chatterbones is where he's he's pointing. Alright. He points off. Um so you guys are kind of like right here. And you need to go, like, right here. So just barely. Barely, like... So you're about, like, right here. You need to go right here. If you can Uncle see my Tam was bad with maps. <laughs> um, whole time it's been upside down. Shadowbox says, I can okay. lead you there. Uh, yeah. Your master commands it. Fantastic. Alright, who has dark vision, by the way? I do. I do. Not I. All right. So John is the only one without dark vision. Technically, yeah, human. Uh, Technically, I don't have it either without my mask. Yeah. Essentially, um, let me get everyone's loaded up then, and all the light stuff corrected. All right, guys. I just. I, I basically tell you that Helm will protect you, and you know, no matter where you wander. <laughs> Uh, Alright, right, so I'm gonna protect us You are in this dark cavern um, You Actually, you approach to the mouth of a dark cave <coughs> And Charbone simply points This is where, where, where we should go Charbones, what's here? Oh, uh, 
I don't rightly know. I haven't been here since my creation. Then why do we have to go here? What's telling you to bring us here? Was, my directive. Was this where, was this where you right. were created? Oh, yes. Were you created by Uncle Tam? By yes. Tam? Yes. Yes, yes, I he was. Built you. He okay. built me. Um, anybody got a light? Anybody got a cantrip of the light for? Uh... I have, a, I have light. Yeah. How it's does like the whole thing? The, Why don't you give the, him a stone? I have ball bearings, so that's what I. I've got a ball bearing, uh, which is bouncy. And take a stone. Take a stone. Don't, uh, don't waste. I, yeah. Can I, I have. Take, I, I have one thousand ball bearings. I'm so. going to take. I'm going to take one of your ball bearings, and I'm going to cast light on it, and I'm going to toss it down the. With your permission. Can you also cast light on a ball bearing for me to put away for later? Uh, I think it's one at a time, but I'm not sure about that. Let me, yeah, let me look I'm it up real sure. quick. It's one at a time. Okay, that's fair. And then, let's yes. do that, let's I... do that one first, and then I'll do that one afterwards, and we'll be fine. Sounds good. All right. I'll take the lead, if unless anyone disagrees. All right, can you see right now, John? I mean, if he's throwing the light down there. Yeah, yeah. He's giving a light. I'm just making sure nothing is showing up on your map, correct? Yeah, I see correct. nothing. Fantastic. Uh, but everyone else should nothing. see. Uh, no, I see dark. Really? I see a hallway. I see a hallway. Okay, okay. Hold on. I see total dark. You do. I've got nothing. So you have to go to your character and say yes on dark vision. Yeah. Oh. Uh, it's under character uh, at the bottom. Blind sight, um, dark vision, tremor sense, true sight. Dark vision, yes. Under what part of the character? Uh, it's on the character. Yep. Dark vision. Type in yes. Uh, I must be missing it. Uh, so core spells equipment. Click oh, character. Uh, I'm sorry, character. Character. Um, and, and they're kind of the mill there. Dark uh, vision. I got you. And yep. I just have to type in yes. Yes, that's correct. And it should take it, make it bold, and then that's what's making mine work at least. Um. Yeah, mine's bold, but it didn't fix it. I'm still not seeing anything. The, what happened is when this this map is rendered, I yep. bet it's an active thing. It took that very about the time. Right. So, can you re put us on the map, Matt? Can you take us off and put us on, Matt? <laughs> yeah. All right. Why don't we hold? Why don't we hold the back lines and we'll let Atlas and Race hold the uh, the front lines. All right. So, essentially, you throw the ball bearing, and it gets around that corner there. You good to move now? Yeah. Just be careful. Don't move too far. Kind of move in like 10 foot, 15 foot increments. I'm so not I leading. Can... So one of you two that are leading. Okay, you start making I'm sorry, where's, where's the entrance, sorry, uh, Matt? Is it there? Yes. That's the entrance. Well, no, okay. that's technically, that's it's, yeah, it's the way you came from. That's entrance is far right. back. Right, uh. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure we were exploring at the same point. All right, um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll snug in here. All right. So we we saw we saw the ball bearing kind of roll around the corner and then disappear, right? Yeah, yeah. Now it's right. So I'm casting light on the ball bearing on me that's in my hand and just kind of holding it up above me and sheathing my sheathing my uh, my uh, mace. So Atlas just disappears apparently. Uh, so I'm going to clean this wall. You guys are taking that wall. I'm going to take this wall and kind of try and stay outside of that line. There. Right. There's only so much you right. can hide from. Here. You're still kind of in bright light right now. Uh, within 20 feet of the ball bearing is bright light. Um, okay, so well, I'm know. kind of hiding around this corner, I guess. This yeah. was... That's fine. We can hide. Yeah. You start going into a cavern. You notice a pool of water. Uh, you can pick up the ball bearing and throw it further in if you wish. Yeah, I'll toss it about there. Just uh, <coughs> farther to make certain right. if there's anything over in this, or is that just clearly a wall? That's clearly a wall. All right. I'll go over here and toss it to about here. Okay. Um, and it rolls a little Matt, bit further. Quick, yeah. I'm going to drop, uh, if this is our, our interest here, I want to drop an alarm spell. Okay. Um, mental image. Uh, basically, it'll it'll ping my mind without making any sound out there. Yeah, that's that fine. 
something has crossed this line. I got you. All right, so yeah. that'll be a spell. So you enter a cave, and there seem to be some naturally fluorescent gems. Gems. And some stalagmites and natural cave pillars as well. Gems? Where are they? Not like crystals, let's say that. Crystals, huh. not gems. Is um, is Chatterbox with us? Yes. He's just far back. I wonder if that thing's any good in a fight. Um, Chatterbox, where are you myself. going? He's you just back. know the cave? Or you know he's at the very there? entrance. No, he's he's at where you uh, cast the alarm, essentially. I I I'd actually want to ask him, Chatterbox, which way are we going, or do you know? Uh, just the cave is, like most caves, very singular in purpose. Hey Matt, will you throw that ball bearing over here? Boop. Thanks. Yeah, right, everyone's guys. kind of checking it out, scoping it out. You got some crystals. They're just mm. kind of glowing. A pool of water that seems the stalactites are dripping water into it, creating ripples. What a smell it is it a smell like good water? Or smell like it smells acidity? like spring water, yeah. Um I wanna take just a bit of it and taste it. It tastes good. Really cold, refreshing. Do, do I see anything right. down here? Is that wall as well? That's all wall, buddy. Alright, I'll that? take this up. I kinda of take it with me. To about this until about uh yeah hold down there. hold down your cursor when you're saying this what's what oh there we go uh who's who's that person right there that's fell that's me fell okay I'm with you fell um I'm just gonna you're kind of the only chance I've got if you stick with me so don't leave me behind uh so how deep's this you, the you don't know are these steps those are steps leading up. <laughs> Or They're down, or depending. Man-made. What? What? Hello? Yep. Uh, someone said something? I, I asked you no, what. You. Oh, no, I'm just asking if there's man made. Alright, uh, I'll no, take this and kind of toss it up to this step. Alright. As you do that, make a perception, everyone. Alright, I was survivaling to see if there were tracks in here, but clearly. Perception. Oh my god, my goddamn rolls! <laughs> Freaking four and four. Oh, Jesus Christ. This ranger is retiring. He's old, he's tired, and he's upset. His his father figure died, so All right. it's okay. All right. I just want the money. Yeah, you guys are good. What do you want to do? Uh, uh, so I I'm... still gotta make my perception roll, sorry. Alright, you guys are good. What do you want to do? I'm going to take a breath and look into the pool. Can I see the bottom of it? No, you cannot. I'm going to move up to here. I'm just going to slide my head back out. It's a pool right now. Um, I I do have the entrance blocked off. Um, let's let's keep going down. Let's see what All right, everyone stop stuff. moving and roll initiative. Uh, I figured out that we've been doing initiative wrong all this time. In 5th edition, it's actually changed up a little bit. It's you, you determine who has surprise, and then you roll initiative. And uh, we're still going to homebrew it a little bit to my way instead of the official way. Um, if you are surprised, you do not act until the end of the first round. Which normally it's till the end of your first turn. Like, and, So essentially, everyone roll... Actually, I don't have... Oh shit, I'm just losing everything, aren't I? Mine's not working, I'm selecting him, but I, when I click initiative, it doesn't do anything. Oh my god, no. to use roll command. Oh, you don't have value. value. There yeah, we go. Yeah. That's what uh, was turn order. Damn it. Uh, you, you, can, you can take my original one, Matt. I, I got the same thing that nothing was popping up. Yeah. Um, the, the 12 was theoretically my first roll. The 20 is after you put the table up, so right. whatever you want to use, I'm, I'm fine with. I'm, I'm not getting... Sorry. I... There it is. Real... There it is. Ah, there it's just go. roll 20 is being real slow today. That's all. Yeah, roll 20 has got a... Um, Fever as well. Shame I can't use that 20, but... <laughs> yeah, I just oh my got God. Why is roll 20 being such terrible? So terrible. 
right now. Hey, we've seen it a bit tonight. It's all right. We're gonna get through it. Yeah, we are. Maybe, maybe roll twenty's got a got a virus too. Maybe it does. <laughs> <clears throat> I'll just have to pop this out then. Where'd it go? All right. Oh my god. Sorry, guys. This is annoying. I'm trying to pop this out. There it goes. It's being kind of lame. All right. The tender rule. And select a token, but no token was selected. Oh, that's why it wasn't working. That makes much more sense. Who are we missing here in the initiative tracker? Uh, me. I'm, I got seven. Oh, okay. um, Doesn't the better to be way to do it, thing. Matt can correct it. If you click on your token mm -hmm. and then click initiative, it's oh, right next to your armor class on core. That's okay. All right. So, yeah, make it seven, though. All right. That's why I wrote first. Yeah. Yep. All right. No, I, I ran into the same problem with lag before, but good enough. I didn't think I needed to actually click on the token first. Yep. And it's just one of those who you're rolling initiative for. Sorry. All right. I didn't no, think sorry. I could roll initiative for someone else. Kind of strange mechanic. Look who's going first. He's going first regardless, technically. Because you all are all surprised. I certainly am. Um, all of a sudden, you guys start to hear a rumble in the earth as... A large creature pops up right here. Surprising indeed. A huge earth elemental just kind of <laughs> appears before you there. Fell, Reese, Reese, and Dannerby. Um, descending. So Atlas technically. What? I just rolled initiative. It didn't add him. Uh, sorry. What's wrong with this image here? At so turn. even though I was keeping my distance, he's aware I'm here. I don't have hidden status. Um, he. 26 if you wanted to have him perceive me, but. Uh, are you moving at all? I like mean, where I've, you I've were moving. On this wall. Yes. yes, he can sense you. <coughs> yes, essentially. Um, you are all surprised though, so he attacks with advantage, and he will slam into both of you once. Uh, oh, sorry, he Dannerby and Reese. He attacks. Uh. If I can get this to work. Dannerby, this attack against you. Critical. Oh. Oh, oh 28. Oh. As he just kind of goes and chest bumps your little body into the ground. How much damage was that? It's a nice having you, dude. 30. Good lord. Is he down? No, not yeah, quite. No, it shouldn't yeah. be a level 5. Yeah. Alright, and then. This is against you, Reese. Miss. 18? Oh, wait. Oh, uh, I was looking at damage. Yeah, that hits. All right. What's 14 uh, bludgeoning damage as he kind of like chest bumps you two. Is this bludgeoning, not magical? Uh, yes. Bludgeoning, right, not so magical. Minus three from that because of the heavy armor master. Yeah. All right. Oh, wait a minute. Can I, uh, can I interject my thing? I've got the... Uh... Anyone who attacks me within 30 feet, I blind them. Like, automatically? Uh, well, I have to I have to roll for it. Alright. Um, you can... Try to blind... Blind him, but he does have Tremor Sense, so... Uh... Bad. Does it have eyes? It does, does have it, eyes. Yeah, it, it, it you would just take away his dark vision. <laughs> Essentially, it would be mildly inconvenient. Okay, All right. um, but I'm still go for it. it. What is it? Hold on, I'm trying to figure out the exact dynamic. Okay. Uh, use your reaction to pose dis disadvantage on the roll. So he has, so he has to roll again for the attack and use the less of the two rolls. All right. Well, let me. Can you roll that? 
so I can see the description in your character. Just click on it and roll it. If that um, makes sense. I don't think I've got it saved like that because it's it's weird. All right, what's it called I'm, again? I'm looking it up. It's it's warding flare. Yeah, warding flare. That's right. We were uh, looking at it earlier. Um. Within 30 feet that you can see, you can use your reaction to impose disadvantage on the attack roll. He can't. He can't, can't be blinded. Okay, then it. Because he has tremor yeah. sense, you can't blind someone who has tremor sense. Yeah, I just, I, I just got to that part too. You're right. The so te- technically, his eyes don't work if he's blinded. Yeah. but he still could. See he still sense. senses no, you, so yeah. it won't work for it's this. Possible to blind. It's possible no. to blind him, but it won't work because he has tremor sense. I'm I'm cool with that. All right. All right. At, oh no, everyone. Let's see here. Let's go through the list. And uh, Atlas, what's your initiative? Uh, if you mean my dex, it's a plus four. All right, so you actually go before him. Why? Oh my God! There's two Earth Elementals now. Roll twenty's just been annoying. Okay. So. Would you say that he has acted in initiative already? Or yeah. No. Everyone no, has I... acted in an. This is round two. Be surprised. Everyone was surprised. All right. That's why um, he acted first, and no one else acted the rest of the round. And now it's round two. You can now act. Okay. He already took a turn. All right. Fair. Um, okay. So I'm gonna uh, move over here. Really, really cool. Uh, I don't know how I'm gonna do it. Tumble, does he, maybe. Does he op attack that? No, because no. I'm moving into his range. It's if, yeah. if I was pulling out. Then. You it's can tumble. Out Absolutely. Uh, make a dexterity or acrobatics. It doesn't do it. I just was more adding flavor. It no, it, there is tumble. Anything. There's actually tumble. Like, if you want to tumble through. Oh, really? Him. If you want to tumble through his square, you can. You're not going to. Yeah, oh. but you're not Or did you just it. say it as flair, it, flavor? I mean, it is flair, but I will look that up later because that could be All helpful. Right. I didn't even know that was amazing. It's in the Dungeon Master Guide, actually. Okay, cool. Question mark. I'll look it up later. Uh, I'm just going to attack. I, I swapped out my Ninja Star for a Wakazashi, so I've got a Katana and a Wakazashi, okay. which to everybody at home, those are just reskinned uh, Rapier and Short Sword. Yep. So, uh, all the mechanics still line up just fine. Uh, I'm going to attack him. So here we go. 26 first AC is 6. Is, and then, uh, is a hit? You have a multi-attack? I, I get another attack. I have two weapon fighting, yeah. Okay. Plus seven. So 22, and that's... Uh, They're both hits. One, two, six. And also, they both hit... Let me see. Do I add sneak attack and only one or both? Probably just one, right? Ooh, that's a good question. Sneak attack. Beginning at first level, you know how to strike Sally and exploit a foe's distraction. Once per turn. Once so per I'd turn. So I'd say once per turn. Yeah. The other extra... Okay. So, so here's a uh, 3d6 sneak attack because right. he's surrounded. Uh, so and specifically, six, I only need two. just so the other guys know how this works. Um, I only need one person within five feet of an enemy for sneak attack to work. If you and I are both going at it on him, um, so eight, so nice. ten, sixteen damage. All yes, nice. This, yes. Yeah, so, all I got slashing. you. So you're just. R- R- ripping, rending him with your wakazashi and katanas, slicing off bits of rock as they fly past you and hit uh, Reese's armor beneath. As you do that, the earth elemental uh, what's burrowing? <laughs> like, like uh... oh, what, do I get an attack him up because he's leaving or is it like withdraw? We'll find out soon. I guess he can't, so. he can't burrow. <laughs> oh, he can burrow. It's not really. He can burrow parts. But not right now. Okay. So he turns at you, turns towards you, makes a <laughs> sound, and nice. slams it. into you. Okay. Or try. Maybe tries to. Who knows? Let's see. We just want to see if the first one hits first. If the sheet will load. There it goes. Jesus, why is it being... Anyways. 
So, 14. Uh, he has advantage? He does not oh. have advantage. Yeah. Right, why, well, did, why did it say it had advantage? I don't know. However, it still misses regardless, but I'm just wondering if he had advantage. So, cool. So that doesn't hit. All right. I, I definitely dodged that. I figured out what I had to do, so we're good now. Um, so he tries it one more time. And it does Ooh. hit. And I'll, right. use my, oh. I'll, I'll use my reaction ability to have that. I'm going to use Uncanny Dodge. All right. And as he does that, he also tries to overrun you guys. Um All right, it's uh, he's going to overrun th in this direction, overrunning three of you in the process, and he's it's going to be strength versus strength, essentially. Oh, Acrobatics oh. to get out of that? Uh, oh, it's be no, no, it, it, this is just to avoid him a taking opportunity attacks. So well, right, that that's not dex at all. That's all strength. It's all strength. Contested by strength. Yep. Okay. Okay. Just so, just toss out a strength saving throw. Yep. Uh, no, not a saving throw. A check. Who's who's actually saving against that? Ooh. Um. It will be Fell, Dannerby, and Atlas. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking lucky, dude. I'm, All right. I'm, so I'm, first one. Yeah. Bro. That's that's gonna be it. I critted that. Because I have negative one strength. That, you said that's <laughs> not a saving throw, though. For it, it's a it's a contested check. Oh wow! Not a oh, not so a I, saving throw, a check. Right, but so I don't get I don't get my ranger uh, proficiency bonus in that. Then okay, Atlas uh, Atlas wins. So Atlas, you can take an opportunity attack. Uh, I will. I will. Oh wait, no wait. Hold on. Okay. Does he get to move through me even though I beat him? All right, the creature attempting the overrun has advantage on this check if it is larger than hostile creature, so hold on. Yeah, go roll another one. Yeah, I will roll another one. Yeah, you it's do gonna, that. It's gonna I be will. worse, but do it. Okay. Yeah. Dude, oh, I mean. <gasps> and oh. 19. Ties. I have, um, negative, I have negative one strength. Yeah, so it, wins. That, it wins. It wins. Yeah. Though. Um, in which case he overruns you three to get behind Phil. With no damage. With no damage. He overruns. Oh. Okay. <laughs> How do you think this thing would like being dipped in that pool? I don't think. Uh, I, I wouldn't. I, I'd just kill it. It's Danerby? A... Danerby, it's your turn. All right. Um. Yeah, no, overrun, all overrun is, uh, is just to, you just try to move. You force your way through a group of enemies without getting op attack. It's the strength version of tumble, essentially. Hmm. Um, so can I, do I still use a free action to call, like to yell something? Yeah, uh, it's fine, free action to yell something. You can talk as free yell... action. I'm going to yell, uh, Chatterbones, get in here and help us, and I'll buy you a golden cape. <laughs> <laughs> Do you hear? Uh, <laughs> Echo throughout the cavern. Does he sound excited? He does sound excited, <laughs> actually. Make a, um, make a persuasion check, if that's what you're a, using. A persuasion, a persuasion yeah, if you, if you want to persuade him as an action. Oh, I'm proficient in persuasion. It'll be your action, though. Oh, is it? Yeah, if you're persuading oh, him through a check. Beat this thing right, down. I still get to move, right? You would still get to move. Okay. I'm going to do it. All right, roll persuasion. With advantage, because uh, he is very excited about that. Oh, so roll I, one more I time. Not, Just roll one more time. Uh, it's fine. Do that in time. It's fine. Roll 20 is being laggy, so <laughs> I thought you hadn't rolled it yet. We have a... Yeah, roll 20 is being a little bitch. Bizatch today. Biznitch. Alright. Slightly better. <laughs> Slightly better. Alright, you're not sure what happened what will happen. Uh but I'm also gonna move. 
as That's far fine. away from this thing as I can get. So, five feet squares? Yes. You can actually pick up your character and while holding space. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Dude. I don't know. Um... Like He's when like you when you when you click it, when you um, click and hold your character, you can hold space, to see the distance, like a ruler. Like go ahead and try that now, it. since you're newer to roll twenty. All right. Uh, it just froze me. All right. Nope. Never mind. Forget about it. Forget about everything. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it froze me Sorry, too. I'm, I'm... Uh, um, man, roll twenty is. Really so killing some vibes right now. Is diagonal? Is diagonal? No, still not in fifth five edition. Spaces or... It's five spaces. Okay, so, one, two, three. So I'm on the other side of the lake from him. That's at least something. Yeah. Cool. On the. All right. Uh, and that's going to be the end of my turn. All right. Um, fell. You see this guy Can just I... basically step over you and your allies and the gemstones and the stalagmites and just. I had my bow out, and I normally I get two attacks. Can I drop the bow, pick up uh, rapier and shield, and still get one attack? As opposed yes, to... just get one attack, though. Yep. So you're All just right. dropping I'm, it, I'm gonna... drawing, able I'm, to attack I'm just once. dropping the bow, and I'm, I'm going to stand up against this thing. Fantastic. Wow, God, my rolls tonight, guys. I am... I am so sorry. <laughs> That's not good enough. Um, you, I, you, I, I you do, do this. On, you just swing your rapier towards him. And it doesn't seem to take off any rock at all. In fact, your rapier just looks dusty. And, and it just kind of glares at you. Reese. Okay. Finally. 5, 10, 15. And I'll... Uh, first of all, I will use Blade Ward. <coughs> okay. This is the one that I haven't been able to get in yet. So you extend your hand and trace the sigil of warding in the air until the end of my next turn. I have resistance against bludgeoning. That's the important one. Dealt from... Is this counting as weapon attacks? Like, it hitting me? Uh -oh. Either way. What? He'd be bludgeoning. Yeah, it's uh, it's actually... Is it bludgeoning? Let me check. Slam. It is bludgeoning. Very good. Uh, for some reason, I thought smashing was a damage. Yeah, <laughs> But <laughs> smashing is bludgeoning, so there you go. There's slashing, hitting it with a blunt object. Wait, that's... Yes, okay. Anyway, so I'll do that, and then I will swing at it with my greatsword. All right, you bring your greatsword to bear, swinging at it. Uh, with a critical, nice. Holy in fact, fuck. actually, it, it's like reeling up to attack on its next turn, and you just take off a part of its arm. Not a, its arm; it's still rock. It's being held together by the elements itself. But you do some good damage to it. Yeah, as it screams in pain. It's more sounds like That's it's just fun. rocks smashing together. Dick All Kevin right. is going to interrupt. Uh, Lynn just got a letter that from the consulate for uh, the marriage stuff, so she's she's going forward with it. Uh, well, that's I was good. really happy. Sorry, Yay. That Yay. she's actually gotten the letter, and uh, every all the paperwork and everything looks to be in order. Fantastic nice. news! So, Congrats, dude. All right, awesome. Yeah, sorry. All right, I'm I'm ready to kill right. giant. Um, so if anyone's looking, um, you see just red eyes in the darkness. Reese kind of behind the monster and you it comes out into the light and you can see uh, Chatterbones just rushing forward and that's as far as he can get. <laughs> Atlas. Uh, okay, cool. So I'm going to take a measurement of my surroundings. There's this stalactite type of thing here. Um, and I need to draw an orange thing actually... on him now. So I'm sorry. <laughs> you should. That'd be funny. Um... <laughs> I drew the yellow uh, sash so, on him. As you can tell, it's really bad. I'm going to try and do my best to disappear behind these guys. It doesn't. I'm not rolling anything. It just doesn't matter. But in terms of like the his body movement, he's just going to like be here, and then he's just not there. Okay. Um, moving over here, 
and he's just gonna, gonna like show up right there in this okay. edition it doesn't really matter where he's looking and all that stuff and it's yeah. not worth rolling stuff so but yeah and he can sense trying. he can sense tremors so he's yeah so he's, he he's like, disappears but then shows up again to, yeah. to more of the party I'm try, trying to show the party yeah. the movement they don't mess with me kind of a thing yeah you, um you slink back up. into the shadows um everything's kind of bathed in a teal light right now from these crystals as well so you just kind of slink back in the shadows and you reappear on the opposite side of him oh so 20 um is a hit i just kind of show up and slice and then come back with the wakazashi all right the wakazashi though doesn't seem to get enough oomph to it it just kind of we got advantage Theoretically, right? You've always played three people or advantage. That's true. You have advantage. Away. That's, you still have advantage. That's why I didn't jump away. So you can roll. I, I was looking up for you, Atlas. For that Wakazashi. Roll again if you want, right. man. So That's a go. hit. He, he, he's going off course, but then he straightens it out right at the last second. And yeah. uh, kind of kind of hooks him. Um, so it's two, 11 plus 2 plus uh, sneak attack. 9. Jesus so 22. Christ. 22 damage. Just... Very nice. It goes... And it goes... And it just attacks you twice. It, there's, oh, it attacks once to Reese, Reese, once to you. Because you both have done pretty good damage. Kind of in one kind of swoop movement. What if I hit this? What happens? Nothing? Okay. Um, normal roll. This, who's this against? The first one is uh, um, Atlas. Second first one. one's gonna hit. All right, all right. First 14 one's does not hit me. All right. All so right. it slams damage. into you for eleven damage, trying to and, bring you to bear, and then and Atlas kind of like takes it, like he he's ready for it, so he takes it. and He only takes like half damage from it. Okay. Um, Dannerby. You notice uh, Chatterbones came running down, kind of scary like. With his red eyes just kind of <laughs> and he clings and clings when he runs um and he got to right there um all right so said Arcana. do you have any do you have any like house rules against shooting through someone on your side uh no not through allies okay you uh, have to fit the I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try to shoot him with a crossbow <laughs> actually like uh enemies and stuff Allies are supposed to provide cover against attacks, apparently. If, if enemies oh, yeah. are shooting through a square, yeah, it's actually like partial cover or something like that. I was it reading, can be. there's a such thing as half cover and three quarters cover. Yeah, there is. Yeah, it's strange, but... It is. Seven eighths cover. Meh. Uh, but I've got, I've got <laughs> a crossbow expert. Alright. So, I can, I can ignore a little bit of cover. I th- oh, no, that's a minute. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine, though. You can. Yeah. He's a big um, target. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot him. I'm gonna shoot him with my crossbow. All right. Draw out your crossbow and you shoot him. Go uh, for it. Uh, there it is. Light crossbow. You, you shoot. Mm, There's okay. kind of like this mist, uh, in the rocks. In, in between the rocks, you know, and it just kind of misses the rocks. It just goes through the mist and out the other side. It doesn't seem to quite do anything to him. Uh, Phil. All it's right. Um, I want to keep the advantage up. Um, if we're surrounding him, let's uh, roll that out. 16 hit. Yeah, uh, 16 does not. With advantage. All right. Remember when you hit oh, that, you can right, say you right. can query with advantage if it's advantage. Oh, you're you're right. So that's yeah, the attack but... number two on this as well. All Sorry, right. and let me roll so, this one. Six. Yeah. That that one should. Twenty five hit. hits. Yeah. So at eleven, that 11, hits. Eleven. Yeah. You, you draw your rapier. The first little slash doesn't go through. You kind of backhand it, and it gouges right. him another, slightly. Another three then for that ranger ability. Okay, yeah. Uh, because he's under his maximum. And I'm going to take the attack. Uh, I want to pick up my bow and jump back 15 feet. All right, you will Is take an opportunity attack. Yep. And he, as he slams attack. into you as his only attack. Uh, 
we'll missing miss. you, probably. You go, yep. but you just kind of jump back ever so slightly, and you avoid his slam. Uh, Actually, Reese. I want to put oh. my position right in right. front of him. All right. It doesn't make a difference. Reese. Okay, I will now use... You no longer, no advantage right now, because your third That's compatriot just moved away. All right, Sorry, Board is not concentration, but True Strike is. Okay. Uh, that's what I'm going to use. Uh, there we go. So, All right. you, so you just extend your hand, you point a finger at the target, and let's see, you gain advantage on your first. There, there you go. Yeah, nice. So when it says on your next turn, does that mean right now? Like when I attack it? Perfect. Oh, that it says next turn, not next. No, it means your next turn because it's your okay. turn right now on It'll your next turn. One. Yeah, so you. It's one action though. That's your action. No, I mean I've got Warcaster. Okay, that's right. Quite cool. a misses that. You can cast. That's right. You can. I remember. All right, uh, it's a miss oh, yeah, though, you. unfortunately. Oh, right, right. said you the four. Normally, I can't really do the cantrips and the attack in the same round yeah. until seven. We decided on five. Yeah, I, I remember. And remember, I said instead cantrips, you can make that spells. Okay, cool. Remember? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Because I thought Elder Stein kind of sucked with um, without that option. So uh, you you do that. You point your finger at it. You have your great sword in the other hand. Put both hands on it and swing toward it, but unfortunately, it doesn't seem to connect. Uh, Chatterbones goes, he goes, Yo, you owe, 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 owe me a golden cloak. <laughs> I'm good. Are you good, Kevin? I'm good, man. Uh, Bad things just happen, or? And he misses. Uh, a little bit, but it's okay. Okay? Oh, you have too much fun I'm with D&D to. Okay. Yeah. Oh, fuck. No, I'm good. I'm Atlas, you, you see Chatterbones say uh, Dannerby owes him a new cloak, and m he completely <laughs> misses his attack. He says, I am not configured for this right now. Glad, glad you're here, buddy. Appreciate it. And then, I, uh, I, I'm just a dip, dip, diplomat right now. 15 versus protocol. Etiquette protocol. All right, it's 14. Those they both miss. miss. Actually, you have an advantage uh, because Shatterbones is right there, dude. He just oh, pulled nice. up. Just pulled up. So just roll one more time. 19's a hit. 19's a hit. 10's a miss, though. 10's a All miss. All I needed was one hit. Yeah. 3d6. Or so 5 back. plus. So All right. 17. <coughs> 17 nice. damage. Oh. It just cries out in pain again. As it looks the the new metallic object that is has an orange hoodie or orange hood over him, a brown coke and a yellow sash. Um, just these guys like. Oh, God, and, uh, bones. No, clashing like hell. <laughs> he, uh, <laughs> he is really clashing badly, and he just slams into Chatterbones. Oh, oh, Chatter! Come on, Chatterbones. Uh -oh. We only really need his head and brain, right? Oh, but it that misses, oh, I thought... actually. Chatterbones yeah. got to <laughs> like just stops him and like throws his arm aside, <laughs> and then meanwhile the got other arm is ball, smashing please. into uh, Reese, and that misses. Yep. Fantastic, uh, Dannerby. Whew. Yeah. All right. Uh. That's a tough decision. Uh, I'm going to shoot it with the crossbow again. Okay. Dead air, sorry. <laughs> there it goes. 16 does actually advantage. There's three people. Yeah, well, yeah, you can roll again. Oh, yeah. One more time, roll one more time. Hold that advantage, though. Yeah! That's a hit. Alright, this time the shot goes through. Better damage, too. Yeah. Taking 
the the bolt actually just sticks into the rock and he looks down at it he brushes it off and uh fell it's your turn uh yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna take a shot at it um yeah you're not quite sure like where like how good it's looking because it's like a 15 does not um a 28 28 does. does You're not quite Probably sure not. how it's looking, but you notice there are a lot of just like rock chunks that are just starting to fall off of it, exposing his inner core, so to speak. All right, all right. It took some hits. Yeah, R- Reese. All right. So now I've actually got advantage, but even now we yes. got flanking anyway. So <laughs> exactly. But roll with advantage. Uh. <coughs> Seventeen. Is exactly what you need to do. Very nice. All right. All right. Is and that just what I got? Or uh, this is difficult to. I can't move through that, can I? No. Not, I mean, you can be around it. You just have kind of disadvantage. All right. Oh, you're there. Not enough room to navigate. Um, are you going to attack one more time? Do you have multi attack, oh. right? Why? Yeah, hit him again. Yeah. Yeah, you. Your fifth level. You should absolutely fight her. Okay. I didn't see that, so I, I'll... I can, that, I can yeah. look it up. But I'm the Eldritch Knight, um, essentially, if you're using... You can spell cast and turn of one of those attacks, essentially, is what Eldritch Knight does. But if you okay. don't cast a spell, you can still have... You have access to your multi-attack. Right. I mean, even so. if I do cast a spell... You can't attack twice. Okay, you... alright. Yeah, that's what... Right. Yeah. Yeah, fifth level is an extra attack, so... Alright. <laughs> and that one misses... <laughs> All right, uh, Shatterbones goes again. Who will give me a golden cloak? Come on, Shatterbones. And no, he's not. Oh. <laughs> Atlas got a negative one. Atlas, go Atlas, for it. Atlas, you got this, brother. Atlas, uh, is oh wait, he has advantage. The, the rocks. Just... He oh, does not hit. Take a... Oh, well, he had uh, advantage. At- Atlas can see that the the rocks are starting to fall away, and that the gooey center is is yeah, uh, it's, starting it's to reveal itself. The nougaty core. Yeah. yeah. So he's gonna go ahead and uh, attack. Uh, miss with that. Oh, miss with that. And yeah. And come up with the wakazashi and miss with that. Too. Oh. <laughs> so you're God, trying, damn. but like I'm all the falling, here. like the rocks that are falling off from them, you're hitting those instead, just and you're missing. The part that just you need to hit. Trying to dig, but the rocks are just in the way. Ex- essentially, um, in doing so, he takes two slam attacks against you. Oh, it's good. It's really good. Oh, so, so for that twenty first one, and twenty-seven. Yeah, they both hit. That first one, I'm gonna half the damage as a okay. reaction. Okay, so half the damage to eight, and then you take nine more damage. 17 damage, but you. He took he took half of it because of the rogue thing. Yeah. Right, and that 17 uh, damage that eight plus nine. Yeah, yeah, it's 17 yeah. overall, but right, it's less That's than what, what I, it would have been. Right, I yeah, I bent the 17. Are you are are you all right? Yeah, not really. Uh, uh, did you turn your your blood thing off? You turned the blood thing off, didn't you? Smart. I didn't yeah. have I didn't oh. have time. To, to <laughs> add it. Sorry. Uh, oh, yeah, there'll be a lot yeah. of blood. That's all I'm saying. That last it's, attack right there. Yeah, Basically, Drew, essentially, well, I used to have an API whenever someone was bloodied or something, just like blood would <laughs> splatter out onto the map and stuff. It's pretty cool. I didn't have time to add it this well, time. That's too bad because I'm bloodied as well. Yeah. Yeah, yours would have been a huge blood yeah. stain. It, it was proportional to the amount of damage you took. It was really cool. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. Fell. Oh no, uh, it's Dannerby. It's Dannerby. Dannerby. Your turn, buddy. All right. Sorry, uh, give me the new name, but. No, Sorry, Danner. Dannerby is better than what I had, like, honestly. Um, <laughs> Danner's gonna, your shoot. nickname. Dannerby is what you go by, though, if that makes that sense. That works. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, Danner's uh, your name, and op- Dannerby is your nickname. I'm going to go, uh, I'm going to go light crossbow again. And I'm going to, uh, do I get anything for trying to aim specific- specifically for the center? No, you have advantage though because your allies okay. are all attacking it right now. Is there is there called shots in this? No, there's no called shots in five e. Yeah, it's that was like two e that was taken out. Yeah. 
that's that's what this I. It's gonna be too easy. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do I'm gonna do Bucks. shoot towards the core. All right. Just for X yeah, and... that's fine. Here go we for go. it. Oh, that was 20. good. Oh, that's nice. Um, nice. He looks severely weak and like parts of his arm are continuing to just fall off. He's slumping down. <laughs> You know, just this growling tremble emits from him. And fell. it's your turn as he looks over towards you. I I do actually look at Atlas as a as a sign of it, but I've I fought with Tup long enough. Uh, twenty five hit. You aim your bow, just kind of hoping to get rid of this thing as you see Atlas starting to get weakened and it hits this kind of gooey center and all the rocks start falling faster and faster off of his body and just kind of goes and he falls back into the pool and you see this glowing center just start fading as the depth uh, as he just falls into the pool does he give a thumbs up and, uh, oh wait no that's going to be for chatter tea. that's going to be chatter bones <laughs> Atlas, in, uh, I'm, I'm sliding into you, bud. Take 10 hit points healed. Uh, thanks, man. Fell's, Fell's concerned. He shot the arrow and bolted in once he saw it was dead. Uh, take and 10 it, hit points back. And that'll be one of my kill wounds. In, in, primor in Primordial, I will tell him, good battle, friend. Rest easy. 